Hey everybody, it's Counterclockwise here, and today um, I'm going to show you um, my low class mock of the invasion of Poland um, in World War II, 19, um, I think it was 1939 or 19, somewhere between, somewhere between that time um anyways this is the my mock and um it's a very simple mock um and i'll tell you why a bit towards the end um but yeah so let's get right on to it so, as you notice already, there is a tank right here. This is a German Mardar 2. Um, I'm not sure if it's a Mardar 2. I know it's a Mardar, but oh, one of those German tanks with the, the roof opened. Um, to be honest, it obviously doesn't look like the real thing, but I made it look cooler, so that's one point. Um, hold on, sorry. I also painted, um, the Iron Cross right there. And, um, yeah. Then it has that little machine gun right there. And then the turret. And, um, right here, you can see there's some guys taking cover. Um... As you can see, this is a Polish armored car. Whoops. Um, this is a Polish armored car. Um, I'm not sure what type of armored car. I just built one from looking at a picture. And um, as you can see, once again, a lot of these aren't accurate. And um. The reason why is because I built I built them all out of what I had. To be honest, I think the Polish looked better um, than the Germans. The Germans I use Star Wars helmets for, but I mean it it looks good for the simple design that the helmets have. Um. Yeah, and over here you can see an officer loading up the, loading up the, um, um, the turret, and you can see that he blew out the bunker that that guy was, um, using. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> um, and, um, as you guys probably notice, I'm sure if any of you are quite, um, fascinated with designs and stuff i used um the lego city volcano um volcanic um exploration um vests or not vests um torsos because they looked really good um i just covered up the back so it wouldn't say volcano exploration it would just it would just be normal with backpacks and stuff like that um no yes this is a trench so isn't that pretty cool um oops, this is not supposed to be here um there are some flowers and some weeds and things like that so as you can see over here um this is a um polish sergeant um, right there. And he's running down the trench. Oh, hold on. <sighs> Sorry about that. Um, then you see this guy defending. Um, there with the rifle um then we have a mortar team of one apparently um 
because the other guy got knocked out. Um, but yeah, that's a mortar. Um, and he's trying to take out the the tank, which is kind of a bad idea because you know, like it's right there, and mortars usually are supposed to fire pretty far, not that close. Um, or else it'll be a huge explosion. And, um, still you can see that dead guy. Um, well, if you can see in here, I'm sure you can't, um, well you can, but you can't really get the best of light. Um, you can see that there's where he was supposed to sit, and he's, well, now he's blown up. If you didn't get a good view of that, guess what? You can open the top and you can see inside. See? Um. Then. Yeah. So, this is my short little mock. Um, it would have been bigger, trust me. And I'll tell you why it wasn't that big. So, at my local library. Um, they, they are having a Lego building contest where you have to make, um, you have to make something and you can't use sets or anything like that. Um, but you can use your Lego bricks and things like that. And, um, basically this is what I'm turning in. The invasion of Poland. Um, this is going to be one of my first World War II mocks. I'm going to make even more. Um, but this is what I had in the future. I am probably going to use brick arms and, um, things like that. Um, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, please subscribe, like the video, and, um, share it with your friends. Um, I would like to get at least 50 subscribers um i know that sounds pretty sad um but <laughs> yeah um anyways thanks and bye for now